Good morning, everyone. This is Angel, aka The Beard, which is what these videos will be mainly about. Um, my beard growth over the span of X amount of days. This is day one. It'd be cool to show the growth of beard over X amount of days. I think I'm shooting for about maybe 60 days, maybe more. Um, yeah, maybe I could share some of the things I do when I run too, because <laughs> it's been such a long time since I ran actually. Like, like seriously, on a daily schedule. Alright, that's good. So I kind of got off to a bad start. Not really. I did my laundry this morning. I'll be back to dry. But the bad start was that I over tightened my shorts. You know that strain that goes around the shorts? It's too tight, so it kind of hurts my hip flexors. Uh, it's a nice day. Uh, it's a post candy apocalypse day. November 1st. Look at that. Truck in the alleyway. What a time this video series is over. I guess this is a uh, vlog. Beard vlog. I look completely different. Uh, what I did last night, it pretty much took a good amount of time to shave everything on my face. <laughs> At least 30 minutes, because sometimes there's little bit patches that like to be stubborn and avoid the razor. So yeah, I tried to get it touchably smooth all around. I think it's a nice day. Look at that sun breaking through. That was always a nice sight to see. I didn't stretch before I started running. That's what I normally do, but it's being bad right now. I'll stretch after while I'm in the shower. Once I'm out. I get I think it compliments for my beard. So why not show what goes into growing one? Nothing really. <laughs> but uh, uh it just grows, you know, on its own on its own. I don't have control of it. Really.
we are five minutes in. My beer coat. And uh, you probably said to see nothing. <laughs> it's just it's just a uh, spin and flesh. Another reason I started just sliding to rub my beard because it's uh, November. It's a yearly thing guys do called No Shave November. They grow their beards for a variety of reasons. Initially, I think it was to raise awareness for prostate cancer. I have my own reasons, but I'll share that towards the end of this series. A guy who uh, recently started growing his beard, is, uh, or that I've seen with a full grown beard, a commendable guy. Uh, his name is Jim Carrey. <laughs> and he's totally just had this complete shift in character. Probably not shift, but transition. He's not so. Uh, caught up in material things of the world, much like uh, Keanu Reeves. <laughs> They're simple, simple gentlemen. <laughs> yeah, they make millions, but I think uh, they remained humble. And didn't crumble under pressure of the lesser. <laughs> they might need a hairdresser. <laughs> so yeah, there's always a beautiful things when you go running. I don't know if your mind gets elevated or I don't know, your stress. It's, I guess elevated, which makes your mind more elevated. But it feels good to see things more beautifully. By the way, my ankle hurts. My heart just tight.
that's my fault for not stretching. I might be starting off too hard. I'm just trying, trying to take it easy and build my way up. So I can start running more consistently. So I think I stepped on something and it's not coming up with my shoe. But I don't like to stop when I'm running. Something kind of instilled at me when I was building trails. I said you could slow down but don't stop. Another thing when I, when I was younger, oh, it's 21. Uh, that I was instilled in me was uh what was it that, that wasn't what I was gonna say but uh it's something along the lines of pain is temporary I think that's a completely different train of thought that I intended anyway Guys like ducks and swans. Or, no, not swans, geese. It's a bad duck. Excuse me. Shirt, I think. I don't know if you get a good picture of it, but it's a picture of lines and scribbles. No, not really. Um, it's actually a picture of a tree or a shadow of a tree with lines through it. Challenge your mind or entertain your mind. It's a simple way of being expressive without being considerate, I guess. to uh, my earlier thought. I was mentioning that. Uh, Woohoo to you too. 
He's happy. I'm happy. That's great. That's happy. Um, all right. So my academy, they always mentioned. Uh, don't sacrifice. Uh, a posture or integrity of movement when you're running. So I just I try to remember as well. As slow as I'm going, I always try to maintain my form. I want to send a shout out to uh, Carlito, which is a gentleman I follow on Instagram. He has a pretty nice page where he shows different places he's gone running, which is something I like to do too. I don't generally like to run in the city. I like to run on trails. But the city is nothing against the city. There's beautiful things in the city. It's just a different experience on trails. Well, quite a more simple. It's all about the road. Let's travel. I usually wear a watch, the wristband broke, so yeah. Uh, I'm gonna make this light. By the way, the shoes I'm wearing are hokas, hoka one. They're good shoes. I think I've worn them out too much. Anyway, see you guys tomorrow on my next video. Have a good, wholesome day. Damn, that night was fast. <laughs> well, anyway, I'll see you next time. And uh, gotta catch this light.